guys, David Ronson here. Um, I wrote this, uh, put together this blog uh, to address something that's come up in tech support a few times, uh, <clears throat> missing uh, GUID, okay? Uh, you added a GUID to your database, uh, loaded some services into Revit, uh, but when you go back to click on settings, click on reload configuration, Okay, uh, you get an error or something along these lines. Okay, uh, so, so for some mythical reason, uh, the GUID in the database uh, has been disappeared. Okay, whatever reason that may be. Okay, so I've removed mine. Uh, if I go to version here, you'll see I've taken that out. Okay, so what we can do inside of Revit is recover. Uh, that GUID through Dynamo. Okay, uh, so I'm going to pull up my Dynamo script here. Okay, it's real basic. I'm not going to post this script because it's pretty easy for you to uh, just duplicate it here. You do need the Dyna Fabrication 2017 package, and you're going to use this Get Fabrication Configuration Info um, node. Okay. So we're just writing the GUID to a CSV file, and this is the file path here. Okay, so I can click Run. Real small script, so I don't take any time at all. Uh, I can go to uh, that file. I can copy that. Go back to CAD. Paste it back in. Click OK. OK. I'll go back into the database just to verify that it actually... Uh, retain the information. Now I'll go back to uh, back to Revit. Click settings. Now you'll see that we can uh, reload uh, without getting that without getting that dialog box. Okay. All right. That's all I had for you. I uh, hope you find this helpful.